straight tree that needed to be. So he is willing to pay for it. We, we've got the homeowner that they wanted to put people out. So he's ordered it and he's going to just take care of it and plant it. So while I was talking to him, I asked him about, you know, how, since it was a county road, how he could support it. Um, and he wanted to drive by and look at it. And then we talked again today and they're hesitant about taking on that responsibility of watering it. He thinks like it'll have to be like daily or weekly. Um, and he thinks he he hasn't dealt with trees and planters. Like he thinks nutrients would have to be added. Um, but he he's talked to the county planner, Steve, and he, mm -hmm. and he thought maybe the two of you could talk. They're talking to Metroplex because they do agree that it, not very green. That's what Metroplex said to me. They're willing to look at planters. They just don't know exactly how to make it. Work. Yeah, and then he also said he had talked to who's the, uh, she's on the county legislator and she came to the Dean Street, Sarah. Oh. Ann Pratt? What's her name? Sarah May Pratt? I think so. They had talked about, she had talked about sun sa shape sales, which I didn't know what she was talking about, which are little arcs, which I don't think that's what we're looking mm -hmm. for. So, so how much would it be to like jackhammer? If no, they don't want any planters, put it down in the ground. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's underneath, but he thought there were a lot of utilities and stuff. But it didn't ask them that. I can ask. Because okay. the planters is a tough. I mean, that I think they're right. That that is an enormous. Um, one thing, if you're like picking them up by a forklift and moving them out of the way like they did in Alaska, but um, you know, if Metroplex is unhappy with it and the county's unhappy and we're unhappy with it, then maybe we can find some money to do it, right? Yeah. Yeah, open the concrete up to tree wells. It's the best solution. I just find that it's really hard to get engineers to do that right after they pour the concrete. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Right. Because it's so beautiful. It's, it's so not though. I mean, it's like it's orange patterned. It's not even brick. No, I completely it's, agree. It's <laughs> I think they just really like to see like uncracked surfaces. <laughs> I'll I'll ask. It's probably the best solution is to put some in the ground tree wells. Sometimes you realize, oops, our bad. We forgot something really important. Let's go back and do it. I actually got it at the very beginning. I'm sure you did. And it's a uh, larger tree. Well, then just don't say I told you so out loud. <laughs> I know it doesn't end well. <laughs> okay. Uh, everything right laura nobody will get it but it is warm enough now that i think you could send an email about um oh email oh the one that you wrote yeah because we were saving that to the spring and near arbor day but yeah just letting you know that <laughs> well, well, it'll be was, your test of our email system say, yes he wouldn't even get it more than last time, though. Yeah, okay. Actually, Erin was working really hard on that. Because the reason that you guys got that is that she went back to the old list and oh, emailed yeah. 50 emails a day because if she does more than 50 emails, it becomes spam. So she went through the old list and was emailing 50 people a day to go, this is the way to get on the new list. And she went through the whole entire old list and sent those emails out. Huh. Through a special system that she made. Because but you know, I was the only one who got it. Unsurprisingly, though, so. you I did. I did look it up, and for some reason, I, I'm apparently signed up to the emergency list, but I wasn't signed up to the news list, which I guess means that I unclicked something or didn't click the right thing. So I hopefully am now on the news list. Just yeah, now, just you now. Might have been able to. Yeah, okay. So right. we'll keep working on it. Yes. I second. All in favor? Okay. See you, everybody.